This is on the site Neutral Ground Martial Arts, and uh, the title is The White Stripe, a neurotic conversation I had with myself. And I got to admit, I'm pulling a Gary this week, and I'm just reading the articles we're doing the <laughs> show. <laughs> Maybe I'll blame it on Byron. I didn't get the show notes until moments before the show. <laughs> but I, I have had time to breeze through it while we're, um, while we're doing the show. It's an interesting article. Uh, and it stems from, uh, I encourage you guys to go check it out, the listeners, but it stems from a uh, conversation he had with himself um, where he was, insecurity was creeping in. He was questioning, why aren't I getting stripes and keeping up with my teammates and stuff? So interesting article. Before we talk more about it, uh, Byron, Gary, how many stripes have you guys had in your career? <laughs> That's a funny question. Gary, you go first. Zero. Yeah. Uh, you've had zero, you've had zero as well, Byron. Yeah, I I'm uh, made it my entire way without getting a stripe ever. And stripes, uh, at least here where we are, uh, really came about uh, maybe four or five, yeah, probably closer to three or four years ago. And I think they're a great tool to help with motivation, yes, and, and to help it with encouragement. Because I, I remember being a white belt with two years, and just like. It's hard to tell how 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 I'm doing uh, with no uh, you know pat on the back as far as recognition like that goes, and so I think it's it's great for people to get those stripes and to to see that. And it, it's been a while, but my wife got a, a stripe on her belt, and it it did pick her up a little bit. Like she's like, I got a stripe, and so when we uh, are so out with people, and she talks about jujitsu, she will frequently mention you know not like bragging, but. I got a stripe and she she's funny to hear her talk about it is like literally unannounced like I didn't know this was happening after we got done rolling uh, they called me to, in the front of class and they took a piece of athletic tape and put it on my belt <laughs> and <laughs> she goes I don't know how I earned it and I don't know why they use athletic tape but that's what happened and now I have a stripe <laughs> and it's just like she feels like she's a little bit better than when she got there and she doesn't see a lot of that while she's rolling although i see it in her and she is definitely getting better but oh definitely she yeah. she sees that we see that in her i think and it wasn't it wasn't my decision to do that it was um coach fox's decision but uh yeah it, i didn't uh, realize the effect it would have um as far as like a little bit of motivation and uh, she's just going to train, just kind of like like Gary and I do. You just go train and, and you have fun. And it, in her case, she tries to have fun and and, and get a little better at jujitsu. And and, uh, and 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 it happens. Is now it's now in Wichita. Maybe just, I think it's more common throughout jujitsu are more stripes. Um, yeah, not a secret. Uh, <laughs> haven't got a stripe yet. I'll get. I guess my first stripe will be on my black belt. And. Uh, that, that that's kind of neat but it just wasn't done back then it's not like uh we weren't the only ones getting stripes but i do think it's a great idea you know some gyms do stripes some don't but uh you know the good thing about jujitsu is it's a long journey to become a black belt it's you're not going to get it in two years uh you're not gonna it, you know it's, it's just not that fast moving martial art where you're you're just going to show up for a couple classes and, and, uh, you know, just get it at a certain time. It's a, uh, you put in a lot of hard work and you do have a lot of time between belts and, and, you know, I think it does show somebody, you know, let's say they're a, a blue belt and, uh, you know, they get their first stripe and they're like, you're just that much closer, you know, when you see that, that stripe on you to get in your purple belt. And then you get another stripe and you're like, man, I'm almost there. I'm getting closer and closer. And, you know, I just think it keeps you on the right path. It keeps you motivated. You're, you're excited to get it. And you, you can see how happy and happy people are just by, you know, their Facebook posts from, you know, getting a stripe. So, you know, I think stripes are great. It, it keeps you on that path. It keeps you motivated. It, it basically, solidifies that you're getting closer you know it's a it's a way you know it's kind of like a little report card you know we don't get report cards and i guess uh, this is our quarterly report card the article is really cool because it it goes through something that we i think we all go through uh quite a bit you know he's uh, aaron is talking you know to himself and he's trying to keep himself positive like wow that person got a stripe good for them but i didn't get a stripe this time 
uh, what's the deal with that? Am I not doing as well? And he kind of walks that conversation and he's always trying to bring himself back up. And the other part of him is like saying, you know, maybe you're not good at this. Maybe this isn't for you. And he's just trying to kind of fight that off a little bit. And I think that's a, a common thing. You know, we start jujitsu and sure enough, there's somebody who started around the same time as you did. And just by the, the way things are, you guys don't get better at the same rate. And so this person may reach the blue belt before you've got two stripes on your belt. It doesn't, uh, <laughs> that's just the way it is on the mats. And just to compare yourself to people all the time is, is pretty, it could be pretty rough on you. And even the other way around, if let's just say Gary and I started, and although Gary and I got our blue belts the same day, let's say Gary got his six months before I did. Uh, and then suddenly I, I figured something out in Gary's game. And now I'm, you know, catching him a lot more. And I've, it's clear that I've surpassed his ability. Now he's going to be down about, you know, I used to be way better than him. And now he's above me in, in, in skill. Just to compare yourself to other people, teammates, opponents, uh, whatever, could be pretty rough on, on the way that you get through jujitsu long term. Yeah, I would agree with that. Um, so, uh, what part do stripes play in that? I mean, do you need stripes to validate your progress? How, and how does your gym do it as far as uh, are there any standards or it's just up to how the coach feels that day? The coach feels that day. 